Okay, hi, this is Fia. Today I thought we would do something concerning miniatures. Uh, see if you in frame. Yeah. Here, if you see, and if I can get it to focus. See? I have a, a vegetable selling stand. And today I thought we would make these leeks. And if you see closely, I've made all of this stuff, except all of these leaves and stuff that are, see if I can get you, that are just from plastic plants. Uh, the rest of all of this is made, this is made from wood and all the crates too, and the rest is made from polymer clay with just washes and stuff on them. So today I thought we'd make the leeks. And for this, you're gonna need, okay, and for this, you're gonna need, I'm using a green straw, because that's just easier, uh, but you can make it with a clear or whatever color, because you're still gonna paint it. And you're gonna cut pieces of the straw that fits the length you want. Then you're going to take your scissors and just cut the straw so it opens up. And then this is easier with a smaller scissor. You're just going to cut little uh, snippets about two thirds of the way down. And this is going to become the leaves of your leek. And to my side here, I have my heat gun. <clears throat> On, so I will glue this with my heat gun. Then you take a pair of tweezers. These ones are quilling or uh, uh, yeah, quilling tweezers. Uh, they get a nice fine uh, point, but there are other kinds. Uh, let's see if I can find some. Like these ones would work as well. So you take your tweezers and you take one end of your opening and you're going to twist it together as hard as you can, like so, and pull your tweezers out. So now you have a little curled up together, hope you can see that. And I'm going to take some of my hot glue and just put it on the end and it makes a little bit of a um, bulb on the end which is nice because that is kind of how leeks look and when it starts cooling down you can form it a little bit and that's the beginning of our little leek like so now, here to my side as well, let's see if I can get you in frame, <clears throat> I have some pure white and some dark green paint. So now what we're going to do is just take some of the, I have way too much paint out for this, so take some of the white paint and just paint the bottom of the leak. Like so. And then we're going to turn it, let this dry, of course. And then take the dark green paint and paint the tops of the leafy parts. And then let that dry. Let's see if I can get some. Like so. And these pieces are about one, one and a half centimeters long that I've cut them to. 
And here you see in scale a 28 millimeter figure. I use my miniatures for Dungeons and Dragons playing uh, and uh, also just miniature building. But so here you see it's a pretty good scale. It's a little bit big, but also the table when you're playing is usually a bit big and the stuff is far away. So this is, I think, a good size. And as you can see here, you can see if I can get this in frame and in light, you see the scale is pretty good. So that was it. A really quick one. But I hope you enjoy. Bye.